It occurred a long time ago. A kingdom was ruled by a king. He often wondered why I became the king. One day, to get the answer to this question, he invited the big astrologers of his state. When the astrologers were present in the court, the king put this question before them. At the time when I was born, many other people must have been born at the same time. Why did I become the king among them all? None of the astrologers present in the court could answer this question. An old astrologer suggested to the king that a sage living in the forest outside the kingdom might be able to answer his question. The king immediately set out towards the forest to meet that Mahatma. When he reached the Mahatma, he saw that he was eating embers. The king was astonished, but at that time, the king's priority was to get the answer to his question. That's why he put his question in front of Mahatma without talking here and there. Hearing the question, Mahatma said, Rajan, at this time I am suffering from hunger. I cannot answer your question. There is a hill in some distance. On the top of that, you will find another Mahatma. They will answer your question. You go and meet him. The king reached the hill without wasting time. There too, there was no limit to his surprise when he saw that the Mahatma there was eating his own flesh by tearing it with tongs. The king repeated that question before him. After listening to the question, Mahatma said, Rajan, I cannot answer your question. I am dying of hunger. There is a, there is a village below this hill. There lives a child of five years. He is going to die shortly. You get the answer to your question from him before his death. The king went to the village and met that boy. That child was on the verge of death. Hearing the question of the king, he started laughing. The king was astonished to see a dying child laughing. But he calmly started waiting for the answer to his asked question. The boy said, Rajan, I, you and the two other Mahatmas whom you have met earlier were brothers in the previous life. One day, all of us brothers were having food that a monk came to us and started asking for food. The eldest brother told him that I will give you food. So will I eat the embers? And today he is eating coals. The other brother said that I will give you food, so will I eat my flesh by scraping it? And today he is eating his own flesh by scratching it. When the monk asked me for food, I said that will I die of hunger after giving you food? And today I am on the verge of death. But showing kindness, you gave your food to that monk. It is because of that virtue that you became a king in this birth. Having said this, the child died. The king had got the answer to his question. He went towards his kingdom. Good deeds get good results. That's why always do good deeds and help others as far as possible. For more such stories, please subscribe to our channel and hit the like button.